hurts a whole lot more. Is it hurts a little more or it hurts even more? Which one is it, Mason? Is it like hurts a whole two, lot or hurts the worst? I feel like what is it? One. It's a one? I. Uh oh, hon. Something's wrong. There's even a one on the list. His pain is off the charts. Get the doctor in here. Hey guys, so I'm on my way to the hospital right now. I just got a call from Erica and she said that Mason was on someone's skateboard, fell, hit his face, hurt his nose, and she's getting it checked out right now. So I'm on my way. I don't know how bad it is. I don't know if it's broken. What I do know is I know that Mason's a pretty tough kid and I've seen him take some pretty hard hits and pretty much just get up and laugh it off. Uh, you what? Gucci, bro? Yeah, Gucci. So if he's going to the hospital and he's having to get checked out, then it's probably gonna be pretty bad. So that's the bummer. Hate getting these calls and just hate it when stuff like this happens, but that's part of being a kid. That's part of living life and doing fun things. It's just sometimes you get hurt. And uh, all you people that make fun of us for wearing full face helmets, that's why we do it because we like our faces. Okay, I got a serious question for all you British viewers. Not joking, I'm serious. This is a serious question. If you're a British viewer and you have a bloody nose, how do you explain that to the doctor without sounding like you're vulgar or swearing? How do you do that? How are you supposed to tell the doctor you have a bloody nose? I don't know. We're exactly three days away from the Ryan Volpoto training camp. So hopefully Mason's okay, because it'd be good if he was okay. But also hopefully he's okay, because that would be a bummer if he missed out on his first training camp. Uh, that would be a bummer. Mason. You don't want people to see it? Okay, well cover your nose. Can you just, can you tell me what happened? Can I lay down with you? Sorry, this bed looks too comfy. I need a spot. Can you tell me what happened? No? Okay. Well, Luke, you wanna say what happened? He doesn't know. He never Hi. saw it. No one knows? No one knows. Mason, you're the only one who knows. Yeah, where's the phone it's a mystery. Oh, wait. <laughs> do you wanna at least do a time lapse of the bed going up and down? Do you wanna do that? No? Alright, well, I guess. So we went to drop Lillian off at a sleepover, and then Lillian, I mean, everyone was longboarding. Here. Everyone was longboarding down a hill, and then Mason wanted to turn it, and I'm like, oh no, this isn't a good idea, and nobody went with him, and Mom wasn't paying attention, and he didn't have a helmet on. Thanks. And then. And then he went downhill. I don't know how he crashed or anything. He went to the end of the road. He went to the end of the road, and then we heard screaming. And then there's just this girl on yeah. like a riding this lawnmower, just stand, just like with her ear buds in. So, and then she wasn't doing anything. Okay, well, we'll do an update in a little bit, Mason. Do you want to get a shot of it so that I you can remember? I think you should, so you can remember. I think you should do a video. Okay, disclaimer, this is graphic content. Viewer discretion is advised. Oh. oh snap, oh snap, oh snap. What did you hit with your head? A lawnmower? Did you hit the ground or did you hit the longboard? The longboard? The ground? Did you, were you sitting up or standing up? He was sitting down on the longboard. Yeah, he doesn't want to tell the story, so we'll uh. He's embarrassed. Get out of your bed, but it's so comfortable. There's only one bed in here, Mason. Come on. What are we supposed to do? Lay on the floor? So what are they gonna do? Are they gonna? They're watching. Are they gonna X-ray it or? They won't x-ray the nose, we're gonna have to call the dentist. They're not gonna x-ray the nose? The came in, she said that um, his nose looks swollen, but it's aligned still, because he's so young and it's still cartilage, um, and it's not misaligned, that they don't have to really do anything about it. And yeah. even if you x-ray it, because it is so much cartilage, it's not gonna show up as a fracture anyway. So, because it's aligned, it's just swollen because of the trauma, and then they said that his teeth are stable, 
Let me see uh, your teeth. They look shorter. Do they look shorter than you? Yeah. Do they? Yeah. Like his tooth teeth got pushed up. Yeah. Bend up and half. Oh, <laughs> I'm just trying to fix that, buddy. Try to make sure it doesn't leak into your face. Yeah. Okay. What's the matter? There you go. You good? Are you okay? Yeah. Do you want your paws to fall out? Okay. You're good, bud. Oh, we're gonna watch him pick up on our family. The hole is in it. Wanna see it? Yeah, that's a big chunk of skin. Oh. Well, is that gonna, is that gonna require anything? Mason, how bad is the pain right now? <laughs> is it zero? Is it a two? Mason, is it is it a zero, which is a happy face, a two, which, which is, is like, like you're trying to be happy, but you're not really. It's like a sunset. <laughs> hurts a little more, hurts even more, hurts a whole lot more. Is it hurts is a little it? more or it hurts even more? Which one is it, Mason? Is it like hurts a whole lot or hurts the worst? I feel like... What is it? One. It's a one? I. Uh-oh, hon. Something's wrong. There's even a one on the list. His pain is off the charts. Get the doctor in here. Um, you don't want to see that, Mason. You don't want to see what you look like. <laughs> if he gets hurt, this is a place to do it. Mason, Mason. Okay, so why does it say not an exit when outside? There's literally an exit! What is wrong? What is that? What is it? Are these people actually stupid? Day two. So today's gonna be a busy day. Today's gonna be a good day. We've got somebody coming to look at the PW80 dirt bike here in a little bit, so that'll be fun. And then Mason's got a dentist appointment after that, so that'll be fun. Mason's doing good. I really appreciate all the love and support and comments we're getting on Instagram today, but um, he's doing good. He's got a bunch of energy. He's still running around. He's still spazzing out just like normal. But his two front teeth look like they may have been pushed up a little bit. So we're gonna head to the dentist, have him checked out, get a little, get an expert opinion. I'm not an expert, I don't know, but they look like they're pushed up. So we're gonna go and find out if his teeth need to be extracted. I guess it would be like a partial extraction. They need to be extracted or pulled or um, drilled. I don't know what they do, I'm not a doctor. Mason, you sure you wanna sell it, right? You're okay with that? I want my dinner now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was weird. <laughs> Go count it. Make sure it's all there, okay? Yep. And see? Yeah. Okay, great. All right, Mason. There you go. Can I see? <laughs> oh, you got a new band-aid on. Ah. Guys, do you even have any idea who these are? That's Charlie Brown. That's no, no, that's Caillou. That's not Caillou. That is Caillou. The original Caillou. Caillou is like the current Charlie Brown. He has cancer, bad ideas, and he complains a lot. If you think about it, other than the hair, they pretty much all look the same. I don't think you could tell them apart if it wasn't for their hair. Besides that kid. She's going through Instagram here. Thanks for all the comments, guys. Thanks for all the comments and everybody wishing well. Hunter Schwab says, oh, Mason. David Clark McCall says, I'm glad he's okay. Sean Brown coming in hot with a comment. Jeez, Mason, looks like you got shot in the head. <laughs> <laughs> that one's my favorite. <laughs> yeah, it does. He got shot, not like a shotgun, but maybe just like a 22. Looks like he just got shot in between the eyes with like a 22. Day three. Diabetes forest. That'd be a good place to go camping, huh, Mason? So I can get diabetes? Yeah, would you rather go to diabetes forest or cholesterol canyon? You pick, which one? 
out the eye. So yesterday we went to the dentist and Mason got his teeth checked out. They uh, feel like his front teeth got pushed up a little bit. They're not too concerned. They said it should be okay. It'll take some time. It'll Mason. come back down. But they did do an x-ray and thought there might be a fracture in the nose area, which at the hospital they didn't do an x-ray. The dentist, they did do an x-ray. So now we're at the doctor's office to get his nose checked out again. Okay, so we just got done at the doctor's office. You know what's weird? Doctors don't like being in YouTube vlogs, ironically. I graduated! So the bad news is that, first let me say this, the doctor is, she can't diagnose it, but she's pretty sure that it's broken. They didn't do another x-ray, but they referred us to an ear, nose, and throat doctor, which is overkill. I think a nose doctor would have been just fine, but I guess we'll go to the ear, nose, throat doctor, that's fine. So anyways, the doctor did not clear him to ride dirt bikes, which is a shame because this is the weekend of the Ryanville Poto training camp. But their concern is that with the open wound on his face that has a risk of getting an infection especially riding in the dirt as well as with a broken nose it can um, it needs time to set so we don't want him to grow up looking like Owen Wilson stop please so unfortunately he's gonna miss out on the riding camp this weekend so I'm sorry buddy we'll make it up to you some other time 